begin in the right upper quadrant and identify the hepatic vein as it drains into the IVC. This can also be done in the subcostal region. Enable color Doppler and place the box over the hepatic vein. This also helps to identify it as the flow is predominantly away from the probe. Enable pulse wave and place the gate in the proximal hepatic vein at end expiration a couple centimeters distal to the IVC. Enable pulse wave and observe the waveform over several cardiac cycles. In all but the most severe patterns of congestion, there's first a positive deflection, that's the A wave or atrial kick, followed by two negative deflections, the systolic and the diastolic. A B wave can sometimes be seen between the S and D waves. In a normal hepatic vein tracing, there's first a positive A wave, followed by a deeply negative S wave and a smaller negatively deflected D wave. In moderate congestion, the amplitude of the S wave is reduced and the amplitude of the D wave is increased, and in severe congestion, the S wave becomes positive. In this example, this patient has a moderate congestion pattern.